Welcome to problem number 24 from the June 2014 Algebra Regents exam. In this question we've got a pattern of squares forming here and assuming the pattern continues we need to find out uh, the formula that determines a sub n which is the number of sh uh, shaded squares in the nth term. So it'll help to create a table of values here um, on the left hand side we'll have the term number so one two three and then the right one will be the number of uh, shaded squares. So let's count here. The first term starts off with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The second one looks like it's the same pattern that you can see here, plus 4 more, so that would be 16. And then again, it increases by 4 more, so 20. We can see that uh, the number of shaded squares is increasing by 4 each time and that's why the we're looking for a coefficient of 4 and that's actually in all four of these possible answers so that makes sense. Now to find the coefficient what we can do is pick one of these combinations, let's pick the 216 and um, and we can write out that means that 16 has to equal 4 times n which in this case is 2 plus something. Um, and of course, 4 times 2 is 8, and 8 plus 8 will get us 16. So we can see that the correct answer um, would be a sub n equals 4n plus 8, which is option number 2. All right, that's all for this video. Thanks for visiting JD's Regions Preparation.